Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Andrea. I have been an Etsy seller for seven years. It's my full-time job. And this channel is where I share all the things I'm learning and have learned and just all sorts of things about Etsy. So today we are going to be talking about how to add a listing video to your Etsy listing and five product video ideas. So let's dive right into how and why and all the things about Etsy listing videos. The first thing I wanna cover really quick is what the Etsy listing video feature is. It is a feature that Etsy rolled out, I think it was over a year ago. Um, I'm not sure the exact date, but basically what it is that you can add a short, no sound, five to 15 second video to your Etsy listing. And when the buyer sees it, basically it's it shows up as like your second photo and they scroll through and it just auto plays and loops and it, it's supposed to show off your product. So that is what the video feature is. I want to now talk about why you should even care about it. So I think a lot of times whenever Etsy rolls out a new feature like this, Etsy sellers get like super bummed out, I guess would be a good word because they're like, ugh, another thing to do, which is kind of fair because it is sort of that way, but that's sort of the name of the game of selling on a platform, like any way, like I feel like people think that about Instagram Reels, like, oh, another thing to do, all those sorts of things. So a better way to look at it would be like, oh my gosh, a good opportunity for me, like a new feature, a good opportunity for me to show Etsy that I care and my customers that I care. And that is why you should be caring about it. Etsy definitely as a platform, we know this just from selling, um, selling on it for a long time is that they care about their features and they want you to use them. And so we're seeing things like if you're in your listings tab, you're seeing things like it shows all of the listings that you have that have a video and don't have a video. They're making it obvious that they want their sellers to add videos. Do I know that this in directly impacts your rank in search? No, I don't. But it's definitely wise. It has never, ever hurt me to use the features that Etsy has made available to me. Uh, and so it shows Etsy that you care about your shop. And also it's really, really good for your buyers. In this world where Etsy is all online, you're probably not doing, probably most of your orders are not a local pickup order or a thing where they can come in and buy it in the shop. Otherwise, obviously you wouldn't be running it through Etsy. So it is like a really, really, really good way for someone to see how your product really works. And so it's really, really good for your customer because say you were gonna buy a shirt, you can see it full body, how it moves on someone before you buy it, which is really cool. And so definitely good for showing Etsy that you care about your shop and it's always good to use Etsy features and especially whenever they've made it blatantly obvious that they care about them. And also it's really, really good for your customer. Before we dive into the five video ideas, five ways that you can add video to your listing, I do wanna show you the technical how-to of how to add a video to your listing. So we are going to jump into my screen now. It is very simple. I'm gonna show you guys how to add a video to your listing. Okay guys, so what you're going to do is go into your listings and find the listing that you want to add the video to. I already have mine pulled up. And so you just click on that listing and open it. Scroll down to the video section and click add a video, find the video that you want to upload and double click it. And then your video is going to upload. Once it is finished uploading, you can crop it if you need to. Um, I do not. And so I'm not going to crop it, but that is all. It really is that simple. So from there, all you're going to do is click publish. And then if you wanted to see it on Etsy, this is what it would look like. Okay, so now that you know how to do it, now you know the technical how-to of adding a video to your listing, let's talk about five different video types or ways that you can add those videos and like just get you inspired for your shop and how to, what, what should your videos even look like? The first product idea is an overhead shot of your uh, product, one clip showing every feature. So if we were gonna make this type of video about our monogram wallet, what I would do is I'd set up my tripod over a little um, like white background table or a flat plain surface and I would hit record on my iPhone and I would just start opening up my wallet and showing all of the 
features and all, all the things, and then I'd hit stop, I'd trim off the ends, and that would be my video, making sure that I'm recording horizontally. But that would be, that would be my video. That is the first video idea, very easy to get, very easy for people who have products that are smaller, can that you can like capture, so not like furniture, that you can capture in one shot like that, that is the first product video idea. The second way to get a good video of your product is to capture multiple clips tight and wide and then just stitch them together in iMovie, export and upload them to your listing. This is what most of our um, listing videos are in our shop. So what we have done in order to do this is because we do sell clothing and so I really wanna make sure that I'm showing it on somebody. We have actually coordinated entire photo shoots just for video and the whole purpose was to get video content and then I went through and just clipped together like three or four clips, tight wide, showed every feature, and then exported it and uploaded it to my listing. So that is another way to grab a product video for your Etsy listings. The third idea is for digital products, so you could definitely get inspired if you have a physical product. Digital products show how you use your listing, or show how you use your item with a screen record. So if you sell a Canva template, show you editing that Canva template with a screen record. One shot, super easy to make. You could even add like some text if you wanted to showing off the features super easy video to get show how you use your product with a screen record the fourth video is kind of different but i i love the idea and we're definitely gonna try it in our shop if you sell clothing get a mirror selfie video so walking up and going like showing it like how it moves on you that sort of thing really quick easy 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 to get grab your iphone and just record you wearing your product and showing every little feature in the mirror the fifth and final idea for your Etsy listing videos is to show your process. This is especially good for people who crochet or ceramics or things like that where your process is something that definitely would make people really curious about your shop. You want to make sure that you're showing your process off. I would absolutely love to see something like this from uh, shops that have that I feel like are like true crafts. Like even ours, like I would definitely love to see embroider, embroidery machines running. So the fifth idea is to show off a part of your process. This video is a part one of sorts. Uh, and next week we are talking all about how to actually record the video, tech specifics, all those sorts of things. This was just to show you guys why it's important, why you should care, how to upload the video and video ideas. I wanted to share this one first so that you could really get your gears turning about what kind of product video ideas would work really well for your shop, your item. So definitely if there was like a homework assignment for this channel, like say this channel was school and you had a homework assignment, the homework assignment would be to think about your products and pick one or two videos that you want to make. And next week I'm gonna share a video all about how to actually get the video in the tech specifics and all those sorts of things. So that is all things listing videos. I love video content. Clearly that's why I am a YouTuber. So I get really excited talking about videos. I love the listing video feature and that I'm just really excited to share about listing videos and yeah, anyways. So that's what we're talking about next week. If you are new to this channel, um, this is the channel where I share all about Etsy. I would love it if you hung out, if you're interested in growing on Etsy. I have a free download. It's an Etsy shop scorecard. It just makes sure that you're utilizing Etsy's platform to the best of its ability on your shop. And you can download that at the link in the description. Thank you so much for watching. I can't wait to dive into part two of all things listing video with you next week.